guys welcome back to innovative design tutorial so guys today we are going to create this spool in solidworks and we will also create the weld weight for fit up like uh, ensure that how we fit up this uh, spool by using pipe flange and eccentric reducer so let's see how we draw and design this one in piping so this is the good example uh, for this beginners. design we go to the file select assembly and we just enter the assembly of this solidworks interface now here we change the background to plain white okay to create this uh, spool we go to the uh, routing piping and here we will select welding flange the size of this flange we will keep uh, 4 inch and uh, the class will be uh, 150 rating so just here go and select now we save this assembly ok save it uh, as per your uh, required we will put any other school number ok so here we will select now here we just uh, drag inside like this and here we will put uh, eccentric uh, reducer so we just uh, create like this one go to the reducer select eccentric reducer and select this point ok size we will keep it uh, 100 uh, 4 inch into 3 inch ok so here now exit this sketch select this point drag inside ok now again go to the flange select welding flange simply select and drag to this point the size it will acquire we will keep uh, 3 inch uh, welding flange ok so the actual dimension of uh, both end of this flange we will uh, 210 uh, sorry 290 mm so just we check uh, dimension will uh, ensure it is correct or not so we just go to the me measure now select this one this one ok uh, the, the dimension is more so we will keep uh, just decrease so here cut this one so we will uh, we will less the size of pipe pipe length so it will uh, fit uh, according to our dimension required dimension or actual dimension uh, so select this this one and just uh, press and now we minus this part ok so look we will uh, maintain this length so go to the evaluate select measure select this face and this face so look uh, we will uh, just create 290 mm the length of uh, both end of flange will uh, 290 ok so here we create this uh, spool now exit so here is uh, we will apply the material to this pipe also ok So here we just uh, hide this sketch. Look how we hide this sketch. So uh, again, it's time to make the build width. So go to the assembly. Here we select assembly feature. Select build width, and now we just select weld path. The radius we will keep 8 mm. Now select this one. 
and this last one okay so we will uh, go to the velvet folder and now here we can see so the cosmetic world so look so i think uh, this is very smaller fillet so we will just keep it 10 mm radius fillet so again go to change it 10 mm weld path so we select this one again go to the select more weld path select this line and this inside edge so it will uh, create the building both side uh, inner inner side and outer side also okay so look how we create this belt width like uh, we just first we just fit up and uh, apply this uh, flange reducer mm -hmm. pipes so this is the final design of this uh, spool so look how we just create this assembly and this is the section view of this cutout so cut portion of this uh, pipe so look uh, So guys I hope we will enjoy our tutorial so I will upload many tutorials like piping pipe routing and uh, many more so please subscribe our channel for more video and project thanks for watching